to the Brent Center until Wednesday, December 2nd, when they host the University of Hawaii here. They'll be in a tournament in Kentucky during the week of Thanksgiving. All right, for tonight's starting laps first for the visiting Laverne Leopards, their head coach Richard Reed in his third season. John Liggett will start at one guard. Five foot eight sophomore point guard, second year in the program. He averaged six points a game last year as a freshman. And Leggett is from Arlington High School in Riverside. Billy Nicolini will start at an off guard. He's six feet two inches tall from San Marin, California, out of Novato High School. A part-time starter last year, but played in more than amount of minutes, about 28, 29 minutes a game, and led the team in scoring 11 points a game as a junior last year. Nicolini at the two guard. At the three will be Michael Thomas. Thomas, a local kid, is from Orange, California, out of Pacifica High School, 6'4 junior, first year at Laverne. Trevor Woodland will start at a power forward position. He's 6 feet 5 inches tall. Woodland is a sophomore, and he had 17 points in their victory over the Afghan national team less than a week ago. Good outside shooter can also post up. He's from Covina, California, out of Damien High School. And starting at center, probably the best offensive player, certainly on the inside, Austin Napolitano. 66 is a solid sophomore. Napolitano had 21 against the Afghan national team. He is from San Dimas, California, and also from Damien High School. Head coach for the University of Laverne Leopards in his third season is Richard Reed. Now the UC Irvine Anteaters, their head coach Pat Douglas beginning his 13th season for the Anteaters, the winningest Anteater men's coach of all time. Darren Moore starts at the off guard, six feet three inches tall. He is from Citrus Community College, played his high school basketball at Ayala High School and had 14 points, which was very impressive against Concordia the sophomore off guard. At center will be Zach Atkinson, 6'9", senior, all the way from Bishopville, South Carolina, played two years at Feather River Community College in Sacramento, had nine points in the opener. Michael Hunter starts to the point. 5'10", senior, Aurora, Colorado, out of Smoky Hills High School in Aurora, Colorado. Three-year starter, Michael Hunter, fifth all-time in three-point baskets for the Anteaters. For UCO, by Pavel Lashansky starts at the power forward. Lashansky is six feet eight inches tall. He is from the country of Slovakia. Played the last two years at Butte Community College with his teammate who will come off the bench tonight, Pete Schimmick. That is in Oroville, California. Lashansky figures to be quite a player for the Anteaters. 6'8", junior power forward. And at the three will be Eric Wise, the go-to guy for the Anteaters. Six feet, five and a half inches tall from Riverside, California, out of Martin Luther King High School. Averaged 14 points to lead the Anders in scoring last year. Had six rebounds, second on the team. Second team all Big West, first team all Big West freshman, and a quality, outstanding college player, Eric Wise. Head coach Pat Douglas in his 13th year. Assistant coaches are Doug Oliver, Ross Land, and Ryan Battadelli. Red Soliday is director of basketball operations. Jason Pohamas is a team trainer. Eric Glass, the video coordinator. Our officials tonight are outstanding crew, led by Jerry Scott, Martin Chichokic, and LaDante King. Jerry Scott will step in to throw it up. Atkinson jumping with Michael Thomas and Zach. Five inches taller at 6'9", the 6'4", Thomas controls in the back court. The gold-clad Anteaters with white and blue trim bring it front court. Laverde in green with orange and white trim. They swing it left side to Hunter, three-point land. Mid-post area left side to Atkinson. He comes down the middle, his jump hook from six straight, but an inch long rebound controlled by John Leggett, an exciting 5'8 sophomore point guard from Riverside, California, out of Arlington High School. They give the ball, putting up the shot quickly. Bill Nicolini misses an eight-footer short. Rebound Irvine, they go the other way. The Anders working right to left. No score, 30 seconds in. Hunter on the go, drive the left side, split the defenders, come in deep, and we have a blocking foul on Laverne. Fouling Hunter in the act of shooting. Michael will get two. Hunter, very uncharacteristic of him, missed a couple foul shots against Concordia, and hey, the Anteaters lost by a point. He, an 83% foul shooter last year as a junior. Michael for two, 5'10", senior, sinks the first, one nothing Irvine. 19-21 remaining in the first half. 
Hunter out there with Moore in the backcourt. Wise and Lashonsky, the forwards. Atkinson at center. Michael makes a second, 2 nothing Irvine. Michael Thomas inbounds to John Leggett, 5'8", super quick guard, guarded by one even quicker, maybe even faster, Michael Hunter. On the weave, give it to Billy Nicolini, Nicolini the senior, give it to the sophomore Michael Thomas. They go left side down to Trevor Woodland, his first touch. Now to Austin Napolitano, 6'6", sophomore from Damian High School, and a good offensive player. Pass to the wing, intercepted by Moore. Moore in the open court, drives to the basket, is fouled by Billy Nicolini. And Eaters with Darren Moore, who is a ball hawk, a very good defender. Perhaps, maybe probably the best exterior defender. Michael Hunter would give him a run for his money. Those two, though, two good defensive guards. Moore the steal, fouled by Nicolini, will get two as he went to the rim. Missed the shot, but he'll get two foul shots for his efforts. The first one is good. 3 nothing. And Eaters, a minute and one second in. Darren had 14 to lead Irvine on Monday night. 6-3 junior from Chino Hills. Second one is good. Darren Moore makes it 4-0 Irvine. Leggett dribbling with the right hand, calling out a play with the left. Now the left hand dribble across the timeline for Laverne working left to right. Trying to work a high pick and roll. They pop out Michael Thomas, picked up by Lashonsky. And Hunter from the weak side steals it. Hunter in the open court, 2 on 2 drive to the basket underneath. Finger roll lay it in. 6-0 Irvine early. Timeout, Laverne, a 30-second timeout. We will keep it right here. And Eaters leading 6-0. Woodland to inbound to Leggett. Out there, Napolitano, Nicolini, and Thomas. The Anders, Lashonsky, Atkinson, Moore, Wise, and Mike Hunter picking up John Leggett at half court. Leggett across the timeline, straight out to Thomas on the frontier, 30 feet out. Left wing, they go down to Napolitano, who had 21 against the Afghan national team. Off the ball, a hold against Irvine. Michael Hunter called for the hold. First foul on Irvine. A minute and 31 seconds in, they lead 6 nothing. In batting the ball, John Leggett, the sophomore point guard for Laverne, give it to the senior Nicolini, who averaged 11 a game last year, leaning returning score for the Laverne Leopards. Right side, Woodland, right baseline now to Michael Thomas, working on wise, go down the middle, for a left-hand jump hook, blocked beautifully by Zach Atkinson. He'll block a lot of them this year. They give the ball to wise. He'll block as many as he can stay on the floor and stay out of foul trouble. Zach is exceptionally athletic. Right side, Moore, go to the basket, lean, hang, driving shot, score and draw the foul. Eight, nothing Irvine. One minute, 56 seconds in. Darren Moore has four. Michael Hunter, the other four, so the guards have scored all eight. Quickly into the game will be Matt Hyde for Billy Nicolini, who just picked up his second foul, fouling Darren Moore, who's trying to complete a three-point play the old-fashioned way. Eight, nothing, Anteaters lead it. Free throw by Darren Moore. So good to Lashonsky Bassett, but it's controlled by Matt Hyde, who just checked in. Hyde averaged seven a game last year for Laverne. He is a senior. He is from Wailuku, Hawaii, out of Baldwin High School. And he shot 51% three-point range last year, 19 to 37. So he can drain him outside. He's a left-hander. Give the ball to Thomas. Michael Thomas stops. Free throw line extended. Now to the Palatano. Come through the lane. Try to pass to Hyde. The ball is hit by a player from each team. Last touch by Matt Hyde of Laverne University. Hyde will leave. Into the ball game, Brian Shum. Shum, a 6'5 senior from Covina, Covina, California, out of Charter Oak High School playing with a bandage on his chin. Certainly will not impede his play. Ball in better to Michael Hunter. Now Laverne, a three-quarter court trap, but Hunter nicely weaves his way through that, dribbling the ball, retire the dribble, in low Lashonsky. Pass underneath Atkinson. Slab, duck, left hand, one hand jam. Great pass by Pavel Lashonsky, setting up Zach, who leaned, looked like Superman with his cape on, flowing down the left hand, one hand jam. 11-0 Andeers, make it 10-0 Andeers. A three is short by Trevor Willis. Rebound Irvine, here comes Hunter the other way. Hunter will stop, left side, shoot the three, and bury the three. 13-0 Irvine. Three minutes into it, 17.02 remaining first half. Woodland to the trailer, leg it. Leg it, look down low, get it to Hyde. Hyde double team down there. Ball knocked loose by Eric Wise, taken away by Darren Moore. Give it to Eric, yet to try shot. Alley back, it's a slam, dunk. 
Zach putting on a circus show here with a couple of athletic jumps. Perfect bubble feed transition pass by Eric Wise to Atkinson. 15 0 in eaters. 16 38 remaining first half with the ball going to the basket. Austin Napolitano. Napolitano fouled on the dribble penetration. Non shooting foul. I think it's Atkinson who will get the foul. Adam Folk are in for Zach. No, the foul is on Pavel Lashansky. Folk are in, Atkinson out. Adam Folk are 6'9 sophomore. Fine young player from Markham District High School, all the way from Markham, Ontario, Canada. Folker, a fine offensive rebounder. I think the best offensive rebounder on the squad. Patrick Wembert in for Michael Hunter. Fresh shot clock for Laverne, trailing 15-0 to start the game. 16-30 remaining in the first half. Ball in by the John Leggett, knocked out of bounds by Patrick Wembert. So Wembert in, playing the point, guarding Leggett. Into the ball game, Sam Adams, a 6-2 junior guard, makes that sophomore guard from Moore Park High, out of Moore Park, California, for the Leopards of Laverne University, trying to find their offense and stay in this ball game early. They're in trouble, down 15 nothing. Shum, one down scribble, give it to Leggett on the right side, Leggett around the pick, come down the middle, throw up a prayer, not answered, offensive rebound on Shum, turn around, shot, no, from the weak side to try, Underneath by Matt Hyde and Hyde on the third offensive try is fouled in the act of shooting. So Laverne missing some wild shots but kept it alive. And on their third try, second putback try, catching in midair, Matt Hyde fouled will get two. Six foot senior from Wailuku, Hawaii out of Baldwin High School and he puts Laverne on the scoreboard. 15-1 Irvine. Breaking their 15-0 run to start the game. 16-12 remaining first half. Hyde for the second of two. And that is good. We have a 15-2 Irvine lead. Folker will end down against three-quarter court pressure. One, two, two, three-quarter press, but pass goes easy to Eric Wise, brings it front court. Eric down the middle, reverse pivot. Put up a floating shot through the lane and hit it. Reverse pivot, a half jumper, half moving hook down the lane. One of the trademark shots he has many by Eric Wise. His first deuce, 17 to Irvine. Out in front, shooting a three and missing it, Trevor Woodland from out in front. Makes that, that was not Woodland, it was Tyler Hoyt. Hoyt who just checked in the game out of Servite High School from Placentia, California. The ball passed in low by the Anteaters after getting that rebound to Adam Folker. He caught it and called for an offensive foul. Adam trying a drop step to the baseline called for the player control and we go to a five. Laverne though, nothing for seven from the field. Anteaters token man-to-man -man full court pressure. Ball inbounded to Sam Adams. Picked up by Eric Wise. Adams brings it front court. 6'2 junior, Moore Park, California. Now to Matt Hyde. Out in front, the senior from Hawaii is six feet tall. Down the middle with the ball again is Adams. Adams give it to Leggett. Back to Adams. Open left side. Fire a three. No. Offensive rebound by Matt Hyde, but lost it going up. But the ball was batted inadvertently by an anteater to John Leggett of Laverne. Give the ball to Trevor Hoyt. Hoyt down the middle. Put up a floating shot. Doesn't draw air from six. The former Servite star misses badly. The rebound to Adam Folker. Rembrandt brings it front court. Trying entry pass to Pavel Lashansky, who's fouled from behind. Non-shooting foul. That'll be the fourth foul on Laverne. Each team with 14 fouls. Nicolini has two for Laverne. Folker has two for the Anteaters. That foul going on Sam Adams. Pete Schimmick in for Pavel Lashansky for the UC Irvine Anteaters. Schimmick also from Slovakia, from Bratislava, Slovakia. 6'9", 240. Darren Moore out. Eric Wise out, Derek Strings in for Irvine, and Michael Wilder in for the Anteaters. Wilder, the freshman from Long Beach Wilson High School, Long Beach Millican High School, I should say, inbound the ball to Folker. Folker give it to the junior out of Lakewood High in Long Beach, California, Rembert. 
Now back to Mike Wilder, who stands 6-3. Wilder drive the right side, go to the short corner, pass to Shimmick, 6-9 junior from Butte Community College. Give the ball to Rembert. Now to Fulker. Adam, one bounce dribble. Leaned in, missed a 10 foot bank, missed it. Just a bit strong, long rebound, John Leggett for Laverne. Go right side now to Hyde. Hyde back to Leggett, right free throw line extended. Picked up by sophomore Derek Strings from Pasadena, California. Strings an outstanding shooter. Good offensive all around player. Cuts off Leggett. Leggett tried to pass it through the lane. Strings takes it away. There goes Derek in the open court. Drive the basket underneath and missed the layup. He lost control of the ball going up after getting around Sam Adams. They give it in transition the other way. Laverne and stopping to hit a three. The left hander, a good three point shooter. Matt Hyde makes it 17 5 Irvine. 14 minutes left. Strings a fine steal, couldn't finish. Laverne. A secondary break, got it to the trailer, Hyde, who buried the three. Right wing, three-point land, Mike Wilder. In low, goes to Shimmick, drops up along the base, and goes to the left hand, right side, banks it in. He was too far under the basket to go to a strong hand, just lean with that long left hand, banks it in. Left hand, right side, nice move by Shimmick along the baseline, 19-5 over. High try to hit his teammate, Adams working the baseline, throws it out of bounds for Laverne. Laverne turns it over for the fifth time tonight. And Eater's just one turnover. 19-5 Irvine leads it, 13-42 remaining first half. Rembert, left hand dribble, walk at front court, picked up by Sam Adams. All right, Rembert, bring it right side, straight out to Strings. Derek averaged five and a half a game and better than that in conference play as a freshman. Now to Rembert. Rembert led the team with 85 assists last year. Shimmick has it, left side we go to Wilder. We have a moving screen, Irvine. I think it's on Folker. It is on Adam who quickly picks up three fouls. Well, he's so aggressive out there, but that has not paid off for him in the first half, and just that quickly, Eric Wise in, Folker out. Third foul on Adam with 13.25 remaining. They're gonna need him against Texas and that big front line on Sunday, so better he get the fouls out of the way against Laverne tonight than against Texas when they're going to need him to play some minutes. All right, left side of the ball, Michael Thomas, who started at the three position. Thomas from Orange, California, out of Pacifica High School. Give the ball to Trevor Woodland. Now to Sam Adams. Back they go to big... Hoyt, Hoyt, the 10-foot jumper, no good. Weak side rebound, picked out of the air and scoring. Michael Thomas from the short corner, about 12 feet out left side. Tyler Hoyt misses the shot. The air ball picked out of the air by his teammate who converts. Makes it 19-7 Irvine. Wilder floats at mid post area to Wise. Left side, fake middle. Come along the base underneath and bank it in. Eric Wise. Little good ball fake with that big body. Won the battle of the baseline. Able to get that ball banked up and banked in. Crawling over the rim. Four for Eric. 21-7 Irvine. Adams out in front. Got it closer by Wimbert. The Anteater staying and extended fly paper man-to-man -man defense. The Palatano back in. Give the ball now to Tyler Hoyt. Hoyt, left side now to back. Goes to Adams. Adams in low to high. Turn, spinning, follow away jumper. No good. Rebound Michael Wilder. Wilder, give it up ahead to Rember to the trailer. String straight out. In low wise. Fake middle. Turn back to base. One hander is good from 10 feet out. Hug in the air a moment to let the defender fly by and put up a soft one-hand moving jumper. Eric Wise, so versatile, makes it 23-7 Irvine. Just inside 12 minutes remaining first half. Austin Napolitano guarded by UC Irvine's Pete Schimmett. Left side now to Sam Adams, guarded by Rembert. Adams to the short corner. Bounces out in front with a skip bounce pass reaching Woodland. In low they go, blocks right to Michael Thomas, who hits a nice jump hook over Derek Strings. Thomas an inch taller and outweighs Derek by a good 15 pounds. They post him up, blocks right. He spun baseline and hit a beautiful jump hook 10 feet out. 23-9 Anteaters. Here's Wise, give and go game, fakes the ball, returning it to Rembert. Skip pass right side to Strings, go to the basket, and is fouled hard going to the rim, and Derek Strings goes down hard, landing on his back. Rolls over, he appears to be fine, stunned for a moment, as he went up to maybe dunk it. Fouled hard. Austin Napolitano given the foul. Derek Strings will be at the line to 14 from the field, 21%. They're one for four, three-point range. Rebounds nine for the Leopards, six for the Anteaters. Laverne, six turnovers, UCI two. Mike Wilder returns with Patrick Rembert, Eric Wise, who is three for three from the field. 
Pete Schimmick, and at the foul line, Derek Strings. Strings, a key guy off the bench. I would think Hunter, the best three-point shooter on the team, and right after him, I put Derek Strings. He misses the first free throw long. 23-9, it remains. Next one by Strings is good, 24-9 Anteaters. Brian Shum out there with John Leggett who gets the inbounds pass from Trevor Woodland. Also out there, Matt Hyde and Michael Thomas for Laverne. Bounce pass intended out in front for Hyde. Intercepted by Strings. He'll go to the basket, miss the layup, tip by Wilder, no. Rebound Shimmick, jump hook, no. Ball knocked loose, Anteaters missed three in close there and knocked out of bounds last touch by Pete Shimmick. So Strings a couple of fine steals, but hasn't been able to finish. Has one point of the night, 24-9 Irvine, 11 minutes remaining first half. Michael Thomas springs the front court. Thomas cut off by Wise. They go right baseline to Matt Hyde, spelled H-E-Y-D, senior from Hawaii. Honolulu, oh, I should say Wailuka, Hawaii. Give the ball straight out to Michael Thomas, who'll pass it over the top, Trevor Woodland, as she underneath to Brian Shum, who lays it in. Woodland the assist, Shum the finish, spelled S-C-H-U-M-M, 24-11 Irvine, 10-30 remaining first half. Mike Wilder, high right three-point land, out about 26 feet. He'll hold it up, Wilder bring it near the top of the key, swing it left side now to Rember. Rember on the go, crossover dribble, once, twice, three times, down the lane, hang, left-hander, in and out by Rembert, and the ball deflected out of bounds by Pete Schimmick. Great move by Patrick. Anteaters have not been able to finish a couple of close-in shots the last two sequences. Wholesale substitutions for the Anteaters. Only Wise remains in the game. Hunter in, Lashansky in, Atkinson in, Moore in. Along with Eric Wise for UCI leading 24-11 as we approach the halfway point of the first half, 10.05 remaining in it. John Leggett across the timeline for Laverne, working left to right. Pass at high post to Brian Shum. Shum around the screen by Trevor Woodland. Give it to Matt Hyde. Hyde right to left through the lane, cut off by Moore. Out to Leggett, down the middle, leaping leader. Ten-footer, back wedge of the rim, straight up in the air and fell in. Soft shooters touched by John Leggett, and it's 24-13. So Laverne now giving a good account of itself after falling behind 15-0. They've outscored Irvine 13-9 in the last six minutes. Hunter brings across the timeline, passing to Darren Moore. We have a hold on Matt Hyde of Laverne. For the Leopards, that foul is their sixth, first on Hyde. And Eaters will inbound with a fresh shot clock. To the right of their basket, Eric Wise to do the honors. 9.39 remaining in the half, Irvine by 11. They look forward, they give it to Mike Hunter. Open for the right angle. Raise up, shoots a three, long off the other rim. Ball's volleyball controlled by Brian Shum of Laverne. Leopards bring it front court. This is Leggett to the trailer high. That's his shot. Open for the three and drains it. 24-16 our score. Pat Douglas doesn't like what he sees. Timeout Irvine. Laverne now has outscored the Anteaters. Cern has made a good account of itself. Outplayed the Anteaters the last six minutes. Cut a 15-point lead to eight. Lashansky to inbound against three quarter court pressure now they'll drop back into mine defense and hunter easily brings the front court under some duress by john leggett snap a two-hand chest pass on the wing to moore Darren moore straight out to pavel lashansky lashansky one bounce dribble in low atkinson gave him catch back to lashansky and we have a three second call irvine i believe on zach atkinson and it was Nine minutes remaining in the half, 24-16, Anteaters leading Laverne. Out in front, Leggett, give it, corner of the key, right side now to Trevor Woodland, on the weave to Michael Thomas. Thomas working left to right, pass it right baseline, Hyde for a three, no good, rebound off, knock loose from Lashansky by his teammate Atkinson, the garbage picked up and laid in by Trevor Woodland, and Laverne has cut it to six, 24-18. Hunter behind the back dribble across the timeline for the Anteaters. Hunter one way, then the other, back and forth like a pendulum. Now on the go to the top of the key. Give it to Moore, down the middle Moore. Straight out Atkinson, 17-footer, not close, doesn't draw iron. Rebound off, free ball on the floor. Lashansky tied up by Brian Shum. It will go to Laverne on the alternating possession arrow. 8.27 remaining in the half, and Laverne has cut the lead to six.
Trevor Woodland inbounds to John Leggett for Laverne. Snaps a two-end pass, right free throw line instead of the Matt Hyde. He comes down the middle, laid off to Brian Shum. Skip pass goes from Shum left side to Michael Thomas. He's stripped by Hunter, but the free ball rolls to Hyde. The pass underneath, all alone, but missing the layup. Shum, tip underneath, doesn't go by Michael Thomas. And the rebound, the long rebound to Michael Hunter. Hunter hurries at front court, pass it to Lashonsky. Left side, they go to Wise, drive the left side, lean the basket. Running one-hander from eight, no. Rebound Lashonsky, he goes up and he's fouled in the act of shooting. Two shots for Pavel Lashonsky. Foul going on Trevor Woodland. Lashonsky, 6'8", 235. Last two years in Oroville, California at Butte Community College. He and Pete Schimmick were teammates there of a conference championship team last year in Northern California. Pavel makes the first, spelled P-A-V-O-L. They're both from the country of Slovakia. Second one is good, 26-18. Lashansky converts both foul shots. Leggett, left-hand dribble, picked up at half court by Hunter. Pass a two-hand chest pass front court to Trevor Woodland. Woodland hits Matt Hyde, who slips down under pressure by Darren Moore. Three ball on the floor, rolls to Brian Shum. But Shum got the ball under a collapsing pressure. Two players going to the floor with him from Darren Moore on one side, Pavel Lashansky on the other. Shum traveled, turnover for Laverne. Back to the ball game, Austin Napolitano for the Laverne Leopards who trail 26-18 at the 7.43 mark. Darren Moore, pass to Eric Wise. Eric in the backcourt will hand it to point guard Michael Hunter. Hunter, little cat and mouse game out in front with John Leggett. On the go, Hunter left side. Blocks left, it goes to Wise. He's in too deep. Underneath, put it up and score it. Call for the travel as he did. Well, he pump faked. He had the defender on his hip and must have shuffled both feet simultaneously. So they take the basket away from Eric. It remains 26-18 Irvine. 7.30 remaining first half. John Leggett who has gone almost the entire game at the point for Laverne, had it on a weave to Michael Thomas. Thomas looking for Sam Adams. They go to Adams straight out. Back left side, they swing it now by reversing it to Shum. Brian Shum give it to Lego, working the left side. We've got a reach-in foul going on the Anteaters. It'll be their 16 foul. Foul is on Michael Hunter. Second on Mike, six on the Anteaters. Brand new shot clock for Laverne with 7-12 remaining, trailing by eight. Leggett to inbound, give it to Napolitano, left baseline. He'll shoot, it would have been a three. He'll miss it from the baseline, weak side rebound. UC Irvine's Eric Weiss, quickly to Hunter. Hunter diagonal dribble, brings it front court to the right wing. Now retreat to dribble, bring it straight out, up top on the point. Hunter, 35 feet from the basket on the frontier, directing the offense, setting the table. Hunter, snap a chest pass on the right angle, three-point land to Wise. Eric on the go, cut off, floats a bubble pass, corner of the key, right side of Lashansky. Fake middle, turn the baseline, put up a moving jump for it, and got it. Nice shot by Pavel Lashansky, the assist, Eric Wise. 28-18, Anteaters, Lashansky, the last four Anteater points. Out in front with the ball, Napolitano, first aim, Austin. Hand the ball to John Leggett, their sophomore point guard from Arlington High School in Riverside. Back it goes to Sam Adams, sophomore from Moore Park High, Moore Park, California, to Shum. Shum from Covina, California. Drop it in, Logan Palatano, put up a spinning jump hook, and just fly, swatted away. Weak side help, Zach Atkinson, his second spectacular block. And he was on the move, pass to Lashansky, come down the middle, score it, offensive foul on Pablo. Running the lane, caught the pass, but used his shoulder to fend off the defender, lay it in. No basket, the foul on Lashansky. Started that transition play in secondary break on a great fly swat by Zach Atkinson. Second foul on Lashansky. Mike Wilder into the ball game for Lashansky. Patrick Rembert in the game for Michael Hunter. Rembert, Wilder, Moore, Atkinson, and Wise out there for the Anteaters. Leggett, right hand dribble, brings it front court. Working left to right, Laverne down 10. Hand it to Adams, and Adams throws it out of bounds. Trying to hit his teammate over there. Billy Nicolini. So turnover, unforced turnover by Laverne. 
Nicoli back in, the leading returning scorer from last year for Laverne. He averaged 11 a game. 6'2", senior from San Marin, California, out of Novato High School. Adams picks up Rembert. Adams, a sophomore, Patrick, a junior. Ty post to goes to Wise. In low to Moore. Moore underneath. Turn. Spinning one-hander off the window from six. A little bit long. Weak side rebound controlled. Laverne by Shum. They'll go in transition. Look to push it up. And missing a reverse layup try was Nicolini trying to work left to right under duress. The rebound off. Darren Moore has it. Gives it to Rember. Return it to Moore. Straight out Atkinson. They'll look to reverse it. Instead go back right side on the wing to Darren Moore. Right baseline. This is Wise. Wise works the basket into traffic and is fouled. Holding foul on Laverne one and one time for UC Irvine standout sophomore Eric Wise. Eighth foul on Laverne. And eaters bring in Brandon Scott. His first appearance of the season. Freshman from Los Altos, California, out of Archbishop Mitty High School. He'll play a lot of two guard. He can play the point if need be. And figures to be a fine player at some point for the Andiers. A freshman, a left-hander who can hit the three, and a pretty savvy, pretty good-looking guard. Six feet, two inches tall. He's in the ballgame. Free throw by Eric Wise is good. He's in for Darren Moore, by the way. Eric Wise now has seven points. Anteaters lead 29-18. They've scored the last five. They had a 15-0 run to start the game. Eric dips the knees. Next one is perfect. 30-18 UCI. 5-20 remaining in the initial half. Shum inbounds the ball now to Sam Adams. Adams currently playing the point. Matt Hyde playing the two. John Leggett getting a well-deserved rest. Michael Weider on Sam Adams. They go high post to Napolitano, give the ball to Hyde working right to left. He'll pass up left baseline. A three by Nicolini, short. Rebound volleyball by Water to himself. Tries to save it to a teammate. And in trying to throw the ball back in, it caught the underside of the backboard. And out of bounds to Laverne. John Leggett in. Billy Nicolini out for Laverne. Sam Adams to inbound out there with Napolitano. Into the ball game, Tyler Hoyt. 6'5", sophomore out of Servite High School for Brian Schaub. They'll look for They give it to Adams' right corner, and he had the ball knocked loose from him, and off his fingertips, quick hands by Eric Wise of UCI. Wise forces a turnover from Adams. 30-18 Irvine, 4.55 remaining first half. Rembert, hesitation dribble across the timeline, straight out to Wise on the point. Eric retired the dribble. They go high right three-point land to Rembert. Back out of the frontier, 30 feet out, straight away to Wilder. Throw the bubble pass. Corner of the key, right side to Big Zach Atkinson. On the weave, hand it to Rembert. Back to Wilder. Open right side. Squares up for the three and carries it. Michael Wilder. Fine-looking young player. Wilder, the freshman from Long Beach Wilson High School, at about 6'2 and a half, 6'3. He's a strong kid at 210 pounds. That three makes it 33-18, and he's matching their biggest lead. Down the middle, Lega, pass back door, going underneath and missing the shot underneath was Sam Adams, going to the left-hand right side. The ball knocked out of bounds by Laverne, trying to get their own offensive rebound. Good cut by Adams, good backdoor play, and the pass was there by Leggett. But he's only 6'2". He went up amongst the trees, especially Zach Atkinson. Missed it. And it goes out of bounds eventually to Irvine. Weber will walk in front court. 4'10 remaining in the half. 33-18 UCI. Dribbling with the right hand. Calling out a play with the left. Snaps the chest. Fast down to Brandon Scott. Scott. Two wise, they go left baseline back to Rembert. Skip pass out in front to Wise. Wise look for give it to Wilder on the right angle. Cross court at left side, Rembert. Spot up three. No good rebound. Volleyball by Wise underneath, but controlled underneath there nicely by Austin Napolitano for Laverne. With the ball, Matt Hyde. The pass goes to him, and he tries to ward off using the offhand and call for an offensive foul, trying to get away from... And here's return with Wilder. Remember playing the point. Brandon Scott to two. Wilder to three. Lashansky at the four. Michael Wilder trying a pass into the front court. Knocked out of bounds. It was intended for Brandon Scott. So Michael will inbound just across the timeline in the front court for UC Irvine. Lashansky out there with Atkinson, the anteater five. 
against his own. A 2 3 on the pass down the little Lashansky. Lashansky caught the ball and called for a three second violation. Trying to work it towards the baseline. He caught it, made a nice move, but he took too long in there with the ball. And Eater, six turnover. They lead by 15. Rembert picks up Leggett, who brings it across the timeline. Leggett, sophomore point guard, straight out to Trevor Woodland, guarded by Wilder. They both were 23, and Mike Wilder, this time called for an arm bar and a holding foul. 3.20 remaining in the half. Eighth foul on UCI, one and one time for Trevor Woodland. Woodland had 17 against the Afghan national team. This is UCI, much better product here tonight, having some problems. He missed the free throw. Michael Wilder trying to track it down for Irvine on the long rebound attempt, unable to control it. So they missed the one and one, but they'll get the ball. Right baseline, Will Laverne. John Leggett to inbound. Looking for Woodland, looking for Hyde. They finally get it to Brian Shum back in, the 6'5 senior from Covina and Charter Oak High School. Hyde come down the middle, lost the ball to Rembrandt momentarily, but Patrick couldn't control it. John Leggett picks it up for Laverne. They'll work it down on the right baseline to Woodland, back on the point, straight away to Leggett, guarded right now by Brandon Scott. Crossover dribble, reverse pivot, Scott cuts him off, they'll pass it along the baseline, firing a three from there, missing it is Tyler Hood. They'll give him that three, that's not really his game. Rebound controlled by Scott, Brandon bring it front court to Lashansky. They'll snap a chest pass on the left angle. Three-point land to Rimmer. Back out to Brandon Scott. Scott wearing number 11 is a left-hander. Freshman from Los Altos, California. To the junior, Lashansky. Give it to another junior, Rembert, with 13 on the clock. Look in low, get it to Pablo Lashansky, blocks left. Lashansky across the lane, step through move, nice reverse pivot, put up a floating jumper, no, rebound off, Atkinson has it, he's underneath the score. Three foot baby jumper. Zach having a big first half, and he's staying out of foul trouble. And boy, will they need him against Texas with the size of the Longhorns in a couple days. It will be a much more physical inside presence, of course, for Texas. Out in front, Lager. Raise up, shoot a three, not close, but he's fouled. Three shots coming, the foul by Patrick Rembert. 35-18, Anteaters. Zach Atkinson in the first half, three of five from the field. Six points, three block shots, and a couple of rebounds. Three shots for John Leggett. The foul on Rembert, his first. Both teams in the double bonus, the remainder of the half. We have 2.05 remaining in it. Free throw is no good. Laverne now, after cutting the anteater lead to 24-18 at the 7.56 mark, has not scored in nearly six minutes, while the anteaters have scored 11 straight. So the anteaters' biggest lead of 17. Leggett trying to snap that 11-0 run does, 35-19. Shimmick in, Atkinson out. So Peter plays center, Lashansky at the four. Wilder to the three, Scott at the two, Rembert at the point. And here's two runs of 15-0, 11-0. The reason they lead now by 15 as Leggett makes two of three. 35-20, Irvine, two minutes remaining, first half. 1-2-2, two, two, three-quarter court pressure by Laverne. Andy, there's no problem. Wilder passes to remember quickly right baseline to Brandon Scott. Scott working the baseline, and a violation on Brandon. He stepped on the baseline, trying to work it. So Brandon stepped on the end line. 35-20, Irvine, 150 remaining in the half. Leggett, alternating hands with the dribble across the timeline, picked up by Rember. Bounce pass goes right wing, three-point land now to Matt Hyde, give and go game, back to Hyde right side. Hyde trying to work the basket, threw it away, knocked loose by Lashansky, free ball, Brian Shum tries to save it. Did he save it? He could not. Anteater defense, at times making Laverne look a bit jittery, out of sync. Other times, Laverne giving a good account of itself, but it's been the Anteaters from the get-go, and they lead by 15. One, two, two, three-quarter court pressure, playing catch, Rembert and Water, Patrick across the timeline will hold it up. Rembert directing the offense, Laverne drops back into a 2-3 zone, left side Rembert on the wing. Look for Lashansky and low. not there to Scott out in front. Back to Rembert along the baseline, one dribble, to Lashansky left angle, straight out Scott. Brandon down the middle, hang lean, finger roll, falls over the rim, no. Left hand tip, Lashansky won't go. Nice try by Scott, just couldn't quite get it to fall. Leg it the other way for Laverne. Leopards bring it front court to Woodland. Woodland looking for Michael Thomas. Now they'll go to Michael on the left angle. He comes around to pick this Thomas. Thomas 
from Orange, California is a 6'4 junior working on Wilder. Wilder knocks it loose. Wilder takes it away. Ball picked up loose on the floor by Schimmick. The steal by Michael Wilder. Up ahead to Brandon Scott. Final 45 seconds, first half. Straight out Rembert, 35-20 Anteaters. 25 on the shot clock, 40 on the game. Against the zone, holding it up Wilder. Back right side Rembert. Split the zone, come down the middle, come in deep. Put up the floater, missed it. Rebound Brian Shum for Laverne. They'll play for the final shot of the half. 24 seconds in it, the shot clock put to bed. 35-20 Anteaters. Leg it on the weave, give the ball now to Michael Thomas. Thomas to Woodland. Back out to Leggett. Looking for Matt Hyde, their best three-point shooter. Leggett. Works the right side. Go to the basket. Split to the finish. Laid it off. The ball was knocked loose. Taken away by Pete Schimmick. Three seconds and a half. Wilder down the middle. Michael pull up at the buzzer. A 19-footer just inside the three-point line is long. No good. And we have come to the end of the first half. After the first 20 minutes of action, as you would expect, dominated by UC Irvine, they go to halftime rock Austin time, 11 o'clock West Coast time. You can hear it all on KUCI and the internet. UC Irvine huddling up with 13th year head coach Pat Douglas. Laverne down the scorer's table on the other side, huddling up with their third year head coach Richard Reed. Irvine will return with Eric Wise, Mike Hunter, Darren Moore, Zach Atkinson, and Pavel Lashansky, the same five who started the game. And let's see who Laverne starts the second half. It'll be Trevor Woodland, Billy Nicolini, Austin Napolitano, Matt Hyde, and John Leggett. UC Irvine moving left to right will inbound at half court to start the second half. Eric Wise on the far sideline to do the honors. Eric had eight points, high point man in the game. Give the ball to Mike Hunter straight out. Laverne dropping back now into a 1-2-2 zone defense. 1-2-2 zone by Laverne. They leave Hunter alone, he'll shoot the three and drain it. They'll say, fine, you let me shoot that, I'll make them all day. Hunter, a great three-point shooter, buries that, his second three of the night. Mike has 10, he's now high point man in the game. And Eaters lead, 38-20, their biggest lead. High, drop it in low to Napolitano, in traffic, gets it out right side to Nicolini, open fire a three from the right angle, no good, defensive glass controlled, Eric Wise, UC Irvine, up by 18. Straight out Atkinson, playing a very high post, right wing three-point land hunter, in low to Shonsky, fake middle, turn the base, got the defender in the air, put up the jump shot and is fouled in the act of shooting. Nice footwork by Pavel Lashansky. He'll get two. Foul going on Trevor Woodland, his second. Woodland at 6'5", no match physically for the bigger and stronger Lashansky at 6'8", 235. Pavel for two. P-A-V-O-L is the first name, makes the first. Nice looking foul shooter. Has nice looking shot, period. Lashansky three of three at the charity stripe. Has five points tonight in his Division I debut. Next one, front back rim and tumbles in. He's got six Anders have doubled Laverne, 40 to 20. John Leggett, left hand dribble picked up by Mike Hunter, crosses over once, twice across the tail line, snaps a chance to Woodland, he's open, and Trevor hits the three. Nice little dish off to Woodland, a catch and shoot guy, buried that before the Anders could react. His first three of the night, 40-23 Anders. Hunter down the middle from behind, Leggett knocks it away and steals it, and is controlled by Laverne, Leggett gets a return pass, give the ball in transition, left baseline catching and bearing a 16-foot jumper in transition. Billy Nicolini gets his first deuce of the night, and Laverne, a nice little 5-0 run here, cuts the lead to 40-25. Hunter out in front, go to Moore, Darren right free throw line extended above the three-point line. Right baseline, Hunter gets a pick by Atkinson around it, raise up, shoots the three, won't get there, rebound off, Lashansky has it. Pavel put as the floor, that's not what you want to do, knock loose, but he controls it himself. Does Lashansky give it to Weiss, straight out to Moore, shoot an open three straight away, short off the front of the rim, the rebound run down, Billy Nicolini for Laverne. Up ahead front court to Matt Hyde, to the trainer point guard John Leggett, and back now to Trevor Woodland on the right wing three point lad. He cross courts at left side to Napolitano, their center playing right wing now. 
They return it a second time to Austin Napolitano. Doesn't want it top of the key. Straight out with it. He wants it, but he can't get it off. Back to Leggett. John Leggett with the ball. Seven on the shot clock. Leggett get a high screen and roll. Give it to Woodland. With a one bad scribble around Lashowski. Returns to Leggett. Two on the clock. One. Right base on Nicolini to beat the shot clock. No rebound off. Hit by Darren Moore. He taps it to his teammate, Atkinson, who controls it. Back they go to Moore. Drive the right side. In transition. Lean. Bank it in. Nice athletic shot by a very athletic player, Darren Moore. Bank it in high off the glass right side. 42-25 man eaters. That breaks a 5-0 run by Laverne. The Leopards bring it front court, moving right to left. John Leggett, crossover dribble, come down the middle. Shoot over Hunter, 10-footer. Missed it, but got his own offensive rebound. Back it out to Woodland. He's open, it hits an NBA three, 24 feet out from the right angle. Leggett, a quick shoot move, got his own offensive rebound, following a shot, and kicked it out to Woodland. A catch and shoot three. He's got two of those in the second half. The lead 14. Down low wise, drop step along the baseline, holding foul. Austin Napolitano. Actually, Matt Hyde, who was no match for Eric Wise. Napolitano got him later. Hyde got him first. 17-02 remaining, 42-28, UC Irvine. Eric Wise to inbound. Wise look for Atkinson. Give it to Hunter on the left angle. In Lola Shonsky, in the paint. Down the middle from the mouth of the key and hit the jump hook. Seven feet out straight away in the paint at the mouth of the key. 44-28 Irvine. Lashansky now has eight. Leg it out in front. Retreat the dribble. Kick it in reverse. Give it now to Nicolini. Got it closely by Moore. Hand it over to Napolitano. Got it by Atkinson. Back to Leggett. Hunter all over him like a wet towel. Leggett. Get a high pick. Can't use the screen and roll. Go right baseline to Nicolini. Nicolini straight out to Napolitano. Napolitano left side to Woodland. Shoot a three. That one's an air ball. He was under pressure there that time from Lashansky to Moore. Moore bring it down the middle. He'll bring it all the way. He'll come in deep. Missed the driving shot. Blocking foul going on Trevor Woodland of Laverne University. Third foul, second half on the University of Laverne. And Eaters yet to get a foul. Third personal foul likewise on Trevor Woodland. 16-21 remaining. Darren Moore for two. Darren, a fine all-around player. He gives you a great effort on both ends of the floor. Free throw by Moore is good. Darren has seven. Two of three from the field, three of four from the foul line, a couple of rebounds, and three steals. Moore's got eight. 46-28 Irvine. Their biggest lead was 20 at 40 to 20. Leggett across the timeline works a left to right dribble, but cut off by Michael Hunter. So he'll back it up, kick it in reverse, and bring it out high left, three point land, 30 feet from the hoop. Retire the dribble, looking for help on the pop out Nicolini. Billy Nicolini down the middle, put up a running one handed, right handed shot, no good off the other rim. Long rebound to Hunter. Hunter open court. Hunter drives the basket, come in deep all the way, fouled in the act of shooting. Two shots. UC Irvine's Michael Hunter, which takes us to a media timeout. 15.59 left from the Bren. UC Irvine 46, Laverne 28 on KUCI and the World Wide Web. 80 to 85%, you would think. Shot 83 last year, just under 83 on the season. Makes the first 3 of 3 from the foul line. Could get higher than 85. He's that kind of foul shooter. Hunter has 11. And Eaters by 19, trying to match their biggest lead, and they do. Hunter has a dozen, 48-28 Irvine. All right, Hurley in the front court comes Matt Hyde. Six-foot senior from Wailuku, Hawaii, out of Baldwin High School. Handed off to sophomore point guard from Arlington High School in Riverside, John Leggett. Leggett on the frontier, straight out, guarded by Hunter. Give the ball now to Brian Shum with a bounce pass. Can't return the give and go. They go high-low post, in low to Napolitano. Turn it, hit a follow-away jump hook. The only way he's been able to get anything off tonight over Atkinson, a follow-away spinning jump hook. Nice move by Napolitano. And that goes to show you the presence and shot-blocking ability of Atkinson inside. 48-30. Irvine. Hunter down the middle. On the go. Floater from eight. No good in the paint. Rebound Brian Shum. Give it to Matt Hyde. Hyde heard it across the timeline. Do the trailer. That's Nicolini. Raise up. Shoot the three. No. Rebound. Offensive rebound to Napolitano. And it's another jump hook right side. Again fading away from Atkinson after getting the offensive rebound. That from about eight feet out. The one earlier ten feet out. So cleaning it up with consecutive baskets that time. Austin Napolitano makes it 48-32 Irvine. 
Moore left side. In low they go to Wise, double team comes. Eric escape dribble, back it out now to Moore left side. They'll return it a second time now to Wise. They'll turn square up, face the basket, raise up, shoot a 16 footer and get it. He was a pretty good shooter at that last year. Really worked on his game, squaring up, facing the basket. Eric Wise to be even more versatile. He's got a fine looking shot. Buries that to make it 50, 32 Irvin. Moore intercepts the pass on the wing. Intended for Nicolini underneath Larry then. Darren Moore, another steal. He's got four. And he's got six transition points. He is so athletic, Darren Moore. What a find he is. And Eaters again lead by 20, 52, 32. All right, Leggett. Pass to Nicolini, back to Leggett. To Nicolini again. Nicolini playing the two. Leggett the point. Left side Napolitano working on Atkinson. Go to the short corner. And we've got a push on Zach. Trying to stop the dribble penetration of Austin Napolitano. 14.04 remaining. Pete Schimmick in for Irvine. Michael Thomas checks in for Laverne. Schimmick's in for Atkinson. Lashansky in for Wise. Also checking in Sam Adams for Laverne. So it's Shum, Adams to inbound, Napolitano, Nicolini, and Thomas. Ball given now to Napolitano. Back out it goes to Billy Nicolini. Return it left side to Ryan Shum. Shum give it to Napolitano, guarded by Lashansky. Working on Lashansky, going into the paint, and we've got Pavel called for the block. And Eaters quickly pick up two fouls. The only two they have in the second half at the 13-52 mark. 52-32 they lead. Ball in batted to Napolitano. Napolitano guarded by Big Pete Schimmick. Backdoor bounce pass beautifully, but missing the layup underneath Sam Adams. Or actually Trevor Woodland, I should say. No, it was Adams. It was Adams. 33, not 23. So I missed the layup. The ball goes out of bounds. After a nice backdoor cut and pass given to him, he couldn't convert. And Eaters have it. 1-2-2, two, two, three-quarter court pressure. Mike Wilder just checked in for Irvine at that last dead ball. Give it to Mike Hunter. Hunter breaks the press. Give it to Trevor Wilder. Reverse it left side on the baseline. Moore drive the baseline. Hank put up a double clutch shot blocking foul on Laverne on Brian Shum. 13-31 left. Darren Moore back at the line to shoot two. UC Irvine has never trailed. They jumped out to a 15-0 lead. The only time that Laverne really made the Anteaters sweat a bit was when they went on an 18-9 run over a period of about seven minutes in the first half to cut a 15-0 lead to 24-18. The Anteaters upped it quickly to 33-18 and have never looked back. The lead now by 21 as Darren Moore makes another foul shot. Moore tonight with 11 on 5 of 6 from the foul line, 3 of 4 from the field, he's got a dozen. And Eaters lead 54-32. Sam Adams, left hand dribble, picked up at half court by Mike Hunter. Come around to pick by Brian Shum on a weave, hand the ball now to Michael Thomas. Thomas give it to Matt Hyde, left hander from the baseline, a 3, rattles in halfway down and out. The Paulus the rebound, shot put up, a block by Michael Wilder from the weak side, goes to Hunter, 2 on 1, underneath all the way, lay it in. He looked off the defender. Lashansky was bigger. The defender thought Mike would go to Pavel. He kept him himself. Nice finger roll. But the play started on the deflection and block shot by Michael Wilder. 56-32 Irvine. Left side, Michael Thomas. Guarded by Wilder. Drive left side. Moore knocks it loose. It goes over to Matt Hyde. Hyde come down the middle. Lost the ball to UC Irvine's Pete Schimmick. Moore and Wilder creating havoc. With the ball, Hunter. Split the defenders. Come in deep. Go to the basket. And we have... A call going against Irvine, player control on Michael Hunter. Hunter going into traffic, lost the ball and called for the charge to boot. Into the ball game, Derek Flowers making his first appearance for UC Irvine. Lightning quick and fast, point guard. The heir apparent, at some point is starting point guard for the Anteaters. He'll back up Patrick Rember to Mike Hunter at the point. Flowers from Los Angeles, California out of Pacific Hills High School. An all-state player last year. Where's number zero? Derek Flowers just in the ball game. All right, ball handed to Matt Hyde, working right to left, picked up by Darren Moore. On the weave, give it to Trevor Woodland. Woodland retreat to dribble. Michael Wilder all over him like a wet towel. Back it goes to Hyde. Open, shoot a three, no good. Derek Flowers going for the rebound, bats it, couldn't control it, it goes out of bounds. Flowers will be a crowd pleaser 
believe me. And he figures to see considerable minutes at some point this year. Just getting his feet wet here tonight. Six foot freshman. Ball inbounded Trevor Woodland, guarded by Wilder. So you got a couple of freshmen out there, Mike Wilder and Derek Flowers for Irvine. Right side banking up a shot, not drawing iron is Austin Napolitano. Another rebound, Darren Moore. Give it to Derek Flowers. Darren Moore, left side, Moore on the go. To the short corner, cut off there. Escape the ball to Shimmick, the junior. Give it right side to Wilder. Raise up and drain it. Mike Wilder, a two from 19 feet out, just inside the three-point line. Nice pass by Shimmick, 58-32 hand eaters. Wilder having a fine night. He looks like a player already, beginning his college career out of Long Beach Wilson High School. Flowers all over the defender that time. Sam Adams, they go left side to Matt Hyde, in low Adams, trying to post up a man two inches short of Flowers. He's in deep, put up a spinning jump hook. Adams over Flowers, no good. Shimmick cleans the glass, here here run to Derek Flowers. Shovel underneath the Shonsky, lay it in. Derek Flowers already beating the defense down. Splitting the defenders, got the defense to come to him and laid it off with a shovel feed to UC Irvine's Pavel Lashansky who finished. 11-24 left, Lashansky at the line will try to complete a three-point play. The foul going on Matt Hump tonight for the Anteaters. Darren Moore played a few games last year before going out as a medical hardship. So he is relatively new, and that has really sparked Irvine with, of course, the holdovers and regulars, Mike Hunter, Eric Wise, Zach Atkinson, among others, providing a lot, a lot of excitement for the Anteater fans tonight. Free throw is good by Lashansky. They lead 61-32. Pavel now with 11 points. Out in front on the weave with the ball, Tyler Hoyt. Hoyt out of Servite High School. Give the ball left baseline, pull up. Baseline jumper is long by John Lego. Rebound to Derek Strings. Strings looking to get it going here in the early season. Has one point tonight, 0 for 2 from the field. Sophomore out of losing her high school from Pasadena, California, Derek Strings. He is a sharpshooter. Water out in front. Give the ball high post area, right high post to Lashansky. Left side to Flowers. His first collegiate shot, straight out of three is no good. Rebound off and it will go out of bounds to Laverne. 61-32 Irvine, 10-40 left. John Leggett picked up by Derek Flowers. Leggett crossover dribble two times across the timeline under pressure by Flowers. Out in front Leggett. Leggett loses the ball, goes to the floor. Flowers knocks it loose. Flowers almost steals it and it goes over and back. Over and back. Two players from Laverne touched it. It was deflected during that sequence at one point by Flowers but popped out of the air to a Laverne player who batted it to another Laverne player in the backcourt. Can't do that, over and back. All right, Lashansky with it in the front court to Flowers, freshman point guard, Pacific Hills High School. Behind the back dribble by Derek Flowers. Had the ball hit, knocked away from him. Brian Shump tries to save it before going out of bounds in the backcourt, can't save it. So they set up a nice little trap on Derek Flowers, who learned something from that sequence. The Anders do not lose it. They'll get a fresh shot clock. 10-14 left. 61-32 our score. Wilder, Flowers, Lashansky, Strings, and Shimmick out there for Irvine. Couple of juniors, a sophomore, and two freshmen. And here's by 29. Ball inbound by Wilder. They double team Flowers. Give it back to Wilder. Game of give and go. Pass it quickly left baseline. Strength. One bound scribble. Pull up 18 foot baseline. Jump along. Rebound Lashansky. Give it to Wilder. Might go to the basket. Miss an eight footer and called for the charging foul as he went to the basket. Stops the clock. 10 1 left. The end eaters on their way to their first win of the season. First game of the season, lead by 29, 61-32. John Lega will walk at front court for Laverne, working from right to left. Picked up by Derek Flowers, snap a chest pass left based on Woodland. Open and hit it two, 19 feet out just inside the three-point line, left corner. 61-34 Irvine. Flowers brings it front court. Change direction, dribble, retire it, go to Wilder, high left three-point land. Looking low for Shimmick, not there. Now they interchange with Lashansky, can't go to him. Michael Wilder puts the floor on the weave, hand it to String. Behind the back, Derek down the middle, lean the basket, put up an eight-foot floater, no. Tip by Strings, no. Rebound off, foul underneath, going on Laverne. 
so Derek, a couple of nice moves, just can't get the ball down. Actually, it is not going on, Laverne. It is going on UC Irvine's Pavel Lashansky. His fourth, the team's fifth. Laverne, by the way, with 16 fouls. Stops the clock with 9.25 left. And enters by 27. Here comes Sean Leggett. He's gone almost the entire game at the point. Straight out, give it to Billy Nicolini. Nicolini drop it in low to Hoyt. Tyler Hoyt, one way or the other. Worked to the baseline, put up the shot, missed it. The rebound off and knocked out of bounds by UCI's Pete Shemek. 9-11 left. Brand new shot clock for Laverne. 61-34 Irvine. Ball in, batted by Leggett. Give the ball now to Tyler Hoyt. Back it goes to Lega on the baseline hit. A catch and shoot jumper over Derek Flowers. Timeout Laverne. 18 foot or four straight for Laverne. 30 second trouble reverts to a full timeout. Wallard inbound against full court pressure. They tried to double team strings against the inbounds pass. He quickly returns to Wilder now to Flowers. Derek down the middle to Shimmick. Open the baseline and Pete Shimmick buries one. Short corner left side, 11 feet out. Flowers, second assist, Shimmick a nice looking shot, buries the jumper, 63-36 Irvine. Right side shooting a deep three, Tyler Hoyt, no good, but the long rebound caroms out to John Leggett, point guard for Levert. Left side they go to Nicolini, tries to force it in with a bounce pass to Brian Shum, and we have got contact and a foul going against UC Irvine, I believe. No, they're going to point the other way, it's going on Laverne. On Brian Shum, in a battle underneath. Seventh foul on Laverne. Third on Shum. It was a loose ball, so I guess it's one and one time for Pavel Lashansky. Pavel tonight, 10 points, has made all four of his free throws. He's made all five. He's got 11 points. Now, six of six. Anteaters have made... 19 of 21 foul shots. Boy, they're shooting them well, aren't they? That's remarkable. That's over 90%. 8.36 left. 64.36. You may not see much of the Anteater regulars. They're going to save a lot of that energy for Texas on Sunday when they'll need them for considerable minutes. That one short. No good rebound. Shimmick lay it in. Pete Shimmick rebounding the missed free throw of his countryman from Slovakia, Pavel Lashansky. Shimmick to lay up the Anteaters by 30. Left side cross court pass reaches Tyler Hoyt who hits a baseline jumper. Left baseline 18 feet out, 66-38 Irvine. Eight minutes, 10 seconds remaining. Wilder across the timeline. They're looking to trap when they can is Laverne. Straight out to Derek Flowers. Flowers getting some valuable playing time now. He comes around a pick by Shimmy. Go to the basket underneath. Finger roll and score it. Derek Flowers. Flowers a great looking freshman, 68-38. He is quick on the other end, trying to force the ball hurriedly down the floor. An unforced turnover by Laverna. An errant pass goes out of bounds underneath our basket, which takes us to a media timeout. Our next to last media timeout comes with 7.57 left. Irvine, six. And Flowers. The three perimeter guys, full court pressure by Laverne. Ball inbounded to Wilder. They double team trap him and they steal as he tries to return it. Two strings going underneath and stealing after the steal is John Lega. Put up a shot that is blocked underneath by Irvine. Don't know who got the hand out. I know that Zach Atkinson came up with it and as Zach came down after the block shot, there's a foul. Foul going as they fouled Michael Wilder as Atkinson came up with the ball. And I believe Zach might have blocked it. Two anteaters there. Folker could have gotten a hand on it, but Wilder's at the line. Foul going on Matt Hyde, his fourth for Laverne at the 7.52 mark. Michael Wilder makes the first half of the one and one. Wilder with that basket, free throw I should say, has six points, two of two from the foul line. He's two of two from the field. Played 20 minutes tonight. Next one in and out, no good. 69-38 Irvine, 7.50 left. Rebound controlled by Tyler Hoyt. Hoyt gives the ball to Leggett. Leggett right side now to Hyde. Hyde back to Hoyt. Hoyt underneath, caught it and scored it. 
Little curl pattern, a little game of give and go, and Hoyt got the return pass after handing off, doing a little circle pattern, and laid it in uncontested right hand, right side. 69-40 anteater, Strings with it, one bounce dribble going left, and he's called for the trouble. Derek Strings turns it over. Derek 0 for 5 from the field tonight, the one anteater who has struggled here tonight. He'll get that rectified and quickly. He's a fine player, but having a tough go of it so far tonight is Derek Strings. Right side with the ball holding up Nicolini, trying to hit Trevor Hoyt, working on Adam Folker. Hoyt goes to the floor. It might be on Folker, and I believe it is. Adam picking up his fourth foul, 7.22 remaining. He's got four fouls in four minutes, does Adam Folker. Remains in the game. They get to inbound, his team down by 29. Look for, give the ball now to Michael Thomas, working on Michael Wilder. Skip pass from Thomas, reaches to Palatano, come down the middle, force up a shot in traffic, no good. Rebound off, Wilder bats it on the floor. Patrick Wimbert in the ball game, picks it up for you, Servine. In for Derek Flowers. Give to Mike Wilder, the trailer. Defender falls down, Wilder's left open, he'll shoot a three, front rim short, no good. Wilder gets his own offensive rebound. He is knocked to the floor, flea ball on the floor, jump ball, and the possession arrow is the way of Laverne. So Laverne will get the basketball with 6.58 left. And eaters by 29. The women's tennis team was hosting the UC Irvine Fall Invitational Sunday at Andator Tennis Stadium. To get a preview look at Mike Edlis' women's tennis team Sunday, women's water polo also is hosting its own UCI Fall Invitational. That'll be tomorrow at Antieter Pool. Out in front with the ball, Michael Thomas. Swing it left side on the wing. Three-point land out of John Leyett. Looking to work the pick and roll. Get in deep to Napolitano. Gets the shoulder to Wilder. Missed a shot underneath. Rebound off to Michael Wilder. Napolitano missed a bunny. They give it to Folk in the open court. Adam left-hand driving shot. No. Rebound Atkinson. Go up in traffic. He's fouled in the act of shooting. Two shots for Atkinson. Good try by Folker trying to finish on a quick thread the needle pass through the lane. Leaning with the left hand just wasn't quite long enough, and he is long to get the angle he needed. It spun around the rim. Atkinson, the offensive rebound, and then went up and was fouled by Tyler Hoyt. Hoyt's first, ninth on Laverne. Shooting foul, two shots for big Zach Atkinson. All six of Zach's points in the first half. He's got seven now as he makes the first. UC Irvine leads it 70 to 40, 6.33 remaining. We'll visit with Ross Land and our player of the game afterwards. So I hope you stick tuned for the post game show. Next one by Zach is no good, rebound off. Foul on UC Irvine's Mike Wilder. That means it's one and one time for Laverne. And eaters by 30, 6.32 left. Tyler Hoyt at the line, shooting one and one. The foul going on Mike Wilder, his third. Hoyt for the first half. He made it, he'll get the second. 70-41 our score. Tyler Hoyt now, a total of five points on his evening's work. Played at Servite High School. Next one is good, he is from Placentia. About a half an hour from the Anteater campus. Second one good, 70-42 Irvine. Rembert in the backcourt. Rembert against Leggett. They're looking to double-team Patrick. He's too experienced. He beats it, brings it up the right sideline, reverse pivot, and skips the ball over the top left side to Derek Strings. Strings 30 feet out, back on the point. Rembert, reverse right side on the wing. Three-point land to Wilder. Wilder, one bound shrivel. Shovel pass to Rembert. Right corner, 14 feet out. Rembert backing in. Defender falls down. Offensive foul on Rembert who backed down the shorter John Leggett. The call for using too much of the forearm. 6.08 left, second foul on Rembert, 70-42 UCI. John Leggett across the timeline with now six minutes remaining, handed on a weave to Billy Nicolini, who's had a quiet night. Back to Leggett, take left, go right, down the lane, lost the ball going through the lane, trying to save it, and doing a nice job of it, Michael Thomas, give it to Napolitano, he's open and hits from 17 feet out. Nice save by Thomas, a blind pass over his head on the baseline, caught in midair at the corner of the key, right side by Napolitano, who buried the jumper. 
70-44, full court pressure Levert. Remember, pass to Folker, he's underneath, put up the shot, foul to the act of shooting, two shots for Adam Folker. Nice rifle feed by Rembert as the Anteaters break full court pressure. It'll put Big Adam at the line shooting too. Pete Schimmick will be in in a moment for UC Irvine. 5.36 left. Folker's first free throw of the year is no good. Folker, one rebound tonight. Looking for his first point of the season. 6'9", sophomore, dips the knees. That one is also no good. 360 spin around the rim. Rebound caroms out to Tyler Hoyt. They'll pass it right side to Nicolee. One bounce dribble going right to the baseline. Pull up three, no good. And that ball is tipped out of bounds by Michael Thomas for Laverne. Hyde into the ball game. Matt Hyde for Michael Thomas. Laverne pressing full court with 526 left. More for their own practice than any real strong comeback aspirations here. Strings, hesitation dribble, left hand dribble across the timeline. The two guard for Irvine, give it to Rember. Brandon Scott back in for the end, eaters at the last dead ball. He has it straight out. Reverse left side, back to sophomore, Strings. Strings, look in low for Folker, not there. Crossover move by Strings. Bounce pass to Folker, recovers. Folker, give it back to Strings. Baseline three, crawls over the rim. Weak side rebound, Pete Schimmick. Schimmick step through, move it, hit a nice jump hook. Powers it up over the shoulder players. Using his body with a nice spinning jump hook. 72-44 Irvine. Baseline three, a hurried three by Nicolini, no good. Ball sock loops on the floor. Scott has it. Passed it to his teammate, Rember. Rember across the timeline. The trailer, Schimmick. He caught it, and we have something going on underneath. Hold on. Tyler Hoyt. He leaves the game. He is fouled out. He didn't play a lot tonight. Hoyt, a rugged player. He leaves the game, only his second foul, I should say. It's a double foul. Hoyt and UC Irvine's Adam Folker. So Adam is just fouled out after playing really only about six, seven minutes tonight. Folker leaves. Again, they're going to need him against Texas, so best he get that out of his system here tonight. Leaving the game is Folker on fouls. Leaving the game with his second foul was Hoyt. Out front, Schimmick. Schimmick handed the ball to Rember, looking for strings. Instead to Scott. Rashad Uba has checked in for Irvine for Adam Folker. Cross court, diagonal pass by Scott. Give it to Rember to strings. Come down the lane. Florida, good. Tap the basket with a foul. Great to see Derek get one. He was 0 for 6 from the fields. Hit the nice running jumper. Strings can score in clusters, and they will need him to on many occasions. Fun guy to watch. Got that floater down the lane. The foul going on number 14. Brian Shum is fourth. Derek Strings trying to complete a three-point play, and he does. 75-44 Anteaters, 420 left. Leg it across the timeline. Right wing, the pass goes to Trevor Woodland. Pops out and hits the three. Trevor Woodland, a quick catch and shoot. Woodland has three threes all in the second half. Woodland now... 13 points to lead from February 1st and 2nd to begin the major portion of their season. February 1st and 2nd, the Anteater Invitational and Men's Call. Full court pressure, ball in the hands of Patrick Wimber. Crossover dribble, bring it down the middle, give it to Brandon Scott. Drop it right baseline to Strings. Strings right to left through the lane. Back it out now to Wimber. Open left baseline, 18 footer, no good. Rebound hit by Rashad Uba, the walk on from Martin Luther King High School in Riverside. Out of bounds off of Rashad Uva. Uva 6'6", very athletic and very long. High school teammate, as you would surmise, of Eric Wise. Left side with the ball, Woodland open. Pops out for a three, that one is no good. Rebound to Brian Shum. Back to Woodland, who has 13, straight out to Leggett. He'll shoot a three short. Rebound, Pete Schimmick. You see out of Brandon Scott. Snap a chest pass, open court to String. Strings, revolution pivot, into traffic. Missed the driving shot underneath. Rebound control, Brian Shum. We go the other way quickly for Laverne to Leggett. To the trailer high, back to Leggett, right baseline, and straight out Shum. He'll pass it down the middle, into traffic for Napolitano. Ball sock loose, Patrick Wimber comes up for, for it in the scrum, and it was a scrum on the loose ball, and they foul Rembert. 
He'll go to the line. He'll shoot two when we return our final media timeout. 3.26 left. UC Irvine 75 with a double bonus. Both teams in the double bonus the remainder of the night. Remember, point guard from Lakewood High School. Such a likable young man. Fine basketball player to boot. Grew up in Long Beach. Third year in the program. Was a starter in conference play last year and figures to be in the starting lineup a great deal this year. He makes them both. Remember a couple of foul shots. Patrick tonight gets his first two points of the season. Two of two from the foul line, four points, two rebounds, and an assist for Rembert in about 19 minutes of work. 77-47 Irvine, final 315 of this game. Pass down the middle by Laverne. Goes to Tyler Hood, put up a shot. He lost the ball going up, but he got it back. Give it back out in front now. Into the ball game is Jonathan Bastos, a 6'4", sophomore from Mission Viejo out of El Toro High School. They'll back it out now. To Sam Adams, he'll have a shot blocked, but catching the ball out of the air and laying it in at the last moment is big Chris Browning, who just checked in a 6'6 freshman for Laverne out of El Dorado's, El Dorado Hills, California, and Oak Ridge High School. So Browning on his first offensive sequence, the put back, and eaters with strings trying to pass to Rember, sees his pass knocked out of bounds. Derek Flowers in for UC Irvine. And Jonas Lollizude in for UC Irvine. Lollizude, a walk-on. Jonas, 6'5", sophomore, right here in Irvine at a university high school. Out there with Brandon Scott, Rashad Yuba, and Derek Flowers, the outstanding freshman from Pacific Hills High School. High post to Shimmick. Shimmick the junior from Slovakia. To Lollizude, who scores it. Great to see Jonas get his first basket as an anteater. Jonas Lollizude. Makes it 79-49, and here's 2-12 left. All right, out in front, holding the ball for Laverne is Jeremy Lay, who just checked in the ball game. Lay number 22 is from Claremont, out of Claremont High School. He's a sophomore, so it's Lay, Bastos out there, Browning, along with a couple of regulars, Tyler Hoyt. Now checking in the ball game is Ronnie C, a freshman from Palm Desert High School in Palm Desert, California. Left baseline, a shot is missed. The rebound goes to Derek Flowers Irvine. Fast break, not balanced. He'll pull up himself, corner the key. Missed a 16-footer. It's actually an air ball. Jonas Lollizude tried to get the rebound and in the battle for it, won the possession for Irvine in a battle with Ronnie, actually Jonathan Bastos of Laverne. Lolly Suze, give it to Brandon Scott. He's a good shooter. And hit on baseline two. One foot on the three-point line. 19 feet, eight inches from the basket. Quickly in transition, they'll pass the ball. Shooting and missing from downtown Jeremy Lane. Ball goes to Ronnie C. His baseline jumper no good. And the rebound off controlled by Rashad Yuba. UCI, and Eaters lead at 81-49 on the Scott basket a moment ago. Lolly Zude out in front. One bounce dribble going left. Shot a three, not close. Hit the back wedge of the rim. Rebound about Ronnie C for the University of Laverne. He'll pass it up ahead to Bezos. The ball knocked out of bounds by Jonas Raleigh Zude. 121 left and eaters by 32. So Eric Weiss tonight, minimal minutes. Likewise Michael Hunter. The two go-to guys and principal returning players for the Anteaters. Out in front, holding the ball, trying to find someone to do with it. Jeremy Lay, so wisely pass it off to Bastos. Bastos cross court it back to Lay. He's open to shoot a three, rims in, rims out. Rebound, Jonas Lolly Zude, UC Irvine. Jonas crossover dribble, come in deep, come all the way, lean, bank up a driving six foot one hander, no. Rebound off, foul underneath. The rebound was controlled by Laverne's Ronnie C, spelled S E E, but he pushed off. Actually, he didn't push off, his teammate did. Tyler Hoyt pushed off. Third foul on Hoyt comes with 57 and a half seconds left and it'll put Pete Schimmick at the line shooting two. 81-49 Anteaters. I was starting to say tonight, Michael Hunter played only 14 minutes. Schimmick misses the first of two. Eric Wise, 21 minutes. We'll have Darren Moore on as our post-game guest tonight. Moore, another great game and had an outstanding game against Concordia here Monday night. Moore, 12 points, 3 rebounds, and assists, 3 steals. And his presence 
was supreme tonight in his 19 minutes of action. Next one by Shimmick is good. 82-49 Anteaters, final 55 seconds. Left-hand dribble across the timeline comes Jeremy Lane. Lay spelled L-A-Y, picked up by Brandon Scott. He'll throw the ball over and back. No, it was tipped by Scott. So Laverne will have it. The ball, the deflected pass going in the backcourt, but Laverne's basketball with 23 on the shot clock and 45 seconds left. So we'll have Dylan Moore for you in the postgame show and a visit with assistant coach Ross Land. And Eaters leave early tomorrow morning for Austin, Texas, and the number three team in the country, the Texas Longhorns, on Sunday afternoon. Straight out with the ball, Ronnie C. One bounce dribble, give it left baseline. This is Browning, who hits a three. Nice shot by Chris Browning. He has five quick points in the last three minutes. So Browning playing well. 6'6 six, six freshman from El Dorado Hills out of Oak Ridge High School. Makes it 82 52 Land Eaters. They're not going to take another shot, you don't think. Down the middle comes Flowers. Give to Raleigh Zude. Well, he'll come underneath. Spin up a reverse layup that hangs on the rim. No good. Rebound by Laverne. They'll have one possession with 10 seconds left. Down the middle, Ronnie C. Give it right base on to Bastos. Shoot and is fouled in the act of shooting. Jonathan Bastos. Derek Flowers the foul. Bastos, Bastos, I should say, at the line with six seconds left. 5.8 seconds. 82-52 our score. The foul on UC Irvine's freshman, Derek Flowers. So it's been garbage time the last four minutes and guys who don't get to play a great deal for both sides getting a chance to show what they've got in front of their respective head coaches. Ron Reed in his third season, the fine head coach of Laverne, and Pat Douglas in his 13th season has done such a great job at UCI. First free throw by Bastos, no good. The second one is good, second of three. 82-53 Anteaters. And if he makes this, that should end the scoring. I don't think the Anteaters will even bring it across half court. It is good. 5.8 seconds left. Rashad Uba inbounds to Brandon Scott. Scott in the backcourt with four seconds left. With three. With two. Just holding the ball with one, and that will do it. Final score tonight in the opener and home opener for UC Irvine. They come away with a 28-point victory over Laverne. UC Irvine, 82. The University of Laverne, 54. The Anteaters, 1-0 on the year. Laverne, 0-1. UC Irvine off tomorrow morning to Austin, Texas. Takes on number three, Texas. Airtime, 10.50 Sunday morning as the Anteaters are convincing. 28-point win here tonight. They led by 15 at halftime and jumped out to a 15-0 lead to start the game. We'll take a three-minute break. Back with Darren Moore and Ross Land from UC Irvine and some final stats. That's coming up on the Anteater Post Game Show on KUCI.